Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Ty Sheree, for those that are new. And if you're back, hey, so, hey, ho, hey, ho. So guys, don't forget to please like, comment, and subscribe to your girl's channel. So y'all, we just gonna go ahead and get right into it. I have not done a Gingy video in a while, but baby, I'm just trying to understand for the life of me, why and what is Gingy up to? So, if you have been living under a rock, you do know that Genji went down to 499k subscribers. So, baby, something you're doing, you're not doing it right. Because you're losing subscribers left and right. So, I don't know if it's the purge or it's just that people ain't fucking with you like that, girl. So, at the end of the day, you may just need to take a long needed break at this point i feel like you're just doing struggling content i feel even jazzy over there is doing content and i'm actually over there enjoying her content and i'm hoping that jazzy definitely in my opinion you know continues the trek that she's on but genji you might want to take a page from there just act like you know, even if you have to fake it to act unbothered, because you're bothered, sis. You were so bothered. You're bothered with the house. You're bothered with the man. You're bothered with key essentials. And speaking of key essentials, okay, I am the Tyshire, and I am the face of key essentials. Okay, you gotta be able to execute what you're trying to sell us. And in my opinion, I ain't seen shit. Okay, y'all got this mauve ice coming out, this lip gloss, lipstick coming out. I don't understand for the life of me why you had to be heavily, heavily photo-tuned over there. Okay, so I see Gingy, I see you, I do see that you finally got your hazel eyes that you always wanted. <laughs> Congratulations. But at the end of the day, I just feel like you do not embody the brand. I can see if you always wore makeup, you knew how to, you know, execute, okay? At the end of the day, are y'all buying that shit on Friday at midnight? No, okay? Now, if you're gonna buy it, you're gonna buy it on the strength of that you actually like the brand, you've had the brand before, or you actually like how it looks on someone. But in my opinion, when I look at Gingy, I'm like, Harpo, who is this woman, ma'am? Like, it was just so like egregiously a mess, in my opinion. So if you have not seen it, go over there to Key Essentials on Instagram alert. Now I know some of y'all like Ty, okay, okay. But you know, I know makeup is not for everybody. I know that, I get that, whatever the case may be. But makeup should definitely not change your whole you know, facial situation that you got. You should be able to recognize yourself. So when I did see these heavily edited photos of Genji representing a brand, and I'm looking at it like, I feel like you're probably not gonna get the true hue of the color because Genji done photo edited it to the point of no damn return. Now, y'all sit there and buy that if you want to, if you really wanna support Key essentials you know so i feel like at the end of the day i could be the face of key essentials i am the face i am the brand i can embody and you know make it do what it do okay with the makeup and stuff though okay so let's be clear there so you know key essentials this is a message from ty Sheree to you you got 24 hours baby you can send me something overnight it okay do what it do you know so i can you know, embody the brand for you. <laughs> okay, y'all. So on another note, let's get into these contractors. I don't know what Genji is over there doing because she did make a post or respond to, to someone saying that she paid. It didn't even make any sense. It was like they paid a certain percentage, but they didn't pay 9% of it. Like, ma'am, what is you doing? Like, I just feel like at this point, just throw the whole damn house away and start over, okay? Just start over. Like, just go ahead. Just sell the house right now. Sell the house right now as is because you don't know what to do with it, okay? You say you could give everybody 10K, but baby, 
I don't see it, okay? I don't see it, okay? Now, I ain't trying to be funny with you, but I'm just saying, like, every other day, you coming onto your platform talking about the contractors, the floors, saying, and then the toilet is crooked. Why is your toilet crooked? Ma'am, the hell going on here? Okay, you ain't got no lever. Okay, you know one of them things to make sure it's straight. Who installed that shit? Did you? <laughs> Did babe install it? <laughs> now look like y'all probably did that one late night. Or probably Babe did that one night. Well, he was over there late night, you know, supposedly. I don't know what's going on, okay? But, you know, to stop trying to insert Jeremy and stuff. Like, please stop. We do not care. Because from what you have shown, the footage from the beginning... To right now, it's all been on you. Jeremy has not, okay, not helped in any way, ma'am. I'm sorry to say, okay, I'm sorry. You keep talking about, well, Jeremy going over at the evening time. He ain't doing, what is he going over there doing, ma'am? What is he doing? Because if you don't have the floors, you don't have countertops, Nothing has been done since I don't know how long ago. You know, what is he over there doing? What is he over there overseeing at night? You don't have a contractor, but I don't know what he's doing over there. Okay, what he doing? Okay, do you know? <laughs> yeah, you might want to check that out, Genji, because I know for damn sure of a man telling me that he over at somewhere, you know, trying to do something over here. Listen, and I go over there, it ain't nothing look like it's been touched. We got a problem. We got a problem. Gingy, you really have a problem right now. And I don't know what you can do about it. Nobody's sitting here trying to harass you or bully you. you we're just telling you like it is. You don't want to listen, that is fine. But you or nobody else is going to stop nobody from saying something you put this stuff out here so now you have to deal with it so at the end of the day i don't know what you want us to do so speaking of that i feel like let's transition to peach okay now peach has been going onto her platform talking about oh people are broke people are this people are that but at the end of the day Peach, I'm sorry, but you have brought this to the forefront, okay? I don't know what this is or where this is going right now, but I just feel like when you put stuff out into the universe, people are going to talk. I feel like somebody should have told you, do not discuss your marital issues on the internet. Don't say nothing about your relationship. Keep it between you and your husband. So you cannot get upset because people now, and I'm seeing a lot of videos of people not, you know, feeling peach because, you know, it seems like she's just degrading her subby. Because at the end of the day, how you get it is how it can be taken away. Just know that. So I just feel like humble yourself. And don't worry about what people are saying, people are doing. Just continue to do you. You know, it's just a whole lot, a whole lot of unnecessary drama that you brought upon yourself when you decided to discuss you and your husband's situation. Now, you know, I ain't even mad at it. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you're going to do what you want to do. Get that big bag, big bag, you know, whatever way you feel and see fit but at the end of the day not all money is good money because it does cause a strain in your relationships now i did see where someone said that they slept with your husband i don't know that's a legend i don't know if it was a youtuber but you yourself have definitely said you have seen messages and things of people you know coming into your husband's dm and i feel at the end of the day in regards to that you kind of put that out in the universe so people they that's what they're gonna do i feel like instead of you talking about his shit so fucking good 
It's so fucking good. You know, like, you could have been talking about something else. Because and your husband, you know, I don't know him, nor do I know you. I just know that I took a class. But I'm just trying to give you a little advice. I'm not sitting here trying to, you know, troll you or try to speak negatively about you. All I'm doing is saying the things from, you know, an older woman's perspective. Like, that's things that you do not do. Um, I've learned that, you know, now, and sometimes you might want to pinch yourself, okay? Sometimes you just might want to let it all out, but I feel like at some things you just don't do, you know, at the end of the day. And, you know, you could either take it or leave it at this point, but, um, you know, it is what it is. So, guys, y'all comment down your thoughts below and let me know. What do y'all think Gingy about the situation? What a sub count? The key essentials? The house? Like, I, I, I don't know. It's just so much going on. And I feel like that's a lot of her issue. Real quick, because it seems like she does not have a clear view on where she wants her channel to be at this point. She does all these different things. And like I've always said, Gingy is the type that... When it's not working in her favor, she's just gonna forget about it and move on to something else. Um, in regards to Jazzy, Jazzy's really grown on me, guys. I definitely have been watching my Jazzy's life, and um, I feel like, you know, the past couple of videos I've seen, I'm seeing the growth, I see something there, so I'm hoping that Jazzy, you know, continues, okay, to, you know, do her, don't let the negativity, negativity get to her. But I'm going to say, Jazzy, that damn wig, that Rick James wig, ma'am. Now, I was cracking the fuck up. You know, I really was. But, you know, I'm glad that you decided to go ahead. Do you. I'm, I'm loving it. And Peach, y'all let me know what y'all think about Peach in the situation as well that she's going through. Because I've been seeing a lot, a lot going on. And um, I have been watching her videos. You know, I might talk shit. You know, I wish everybody well. I do. Okay. But I also need key essentials to get in touch with Tasha Ray. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I told you. Okay. I saw the shit out that you. Okay. And stuff though. So, guys, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. This was just something, you know, I put together just for you guys. Um, I guess on that note, y'all just let me know down in the comments. I'll see you. So, there. guys, on that note, as always, be blessed and never stress. And I will see you in my next live or video. Bye, guys. I love you. Oops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>